Hello everyone, welcome back. So, how are you, how have you been, how's your week been and how's your week going? Uh, let's do a quick catch up as we normally do. So, we'll collect this. Just to check in the awards. We've got one more day before we get this bundle of happiness. So, uh, we'll collect social points. So we'll summon and we'll collect the rest of those, that's fine. We won a siege earlier, which is fantastic. So we'll collect those. I think I've collected most of what I need to from here because I've been still doing the dailies and whatnot. So the catch up is on Wednesday afternoon I got hit with something that was either the serious flu or COVID or something bad because on top of what I've got going on, that hit me, I couldn't move. I was out for the count, shaking, freezing. It was just my whole body was in some type of shock. It was, uh, it was not nice. Uh, that went on until Thursday, like afternoon or so. So I wanted to upload, I just physically couldn't. You know, I've, now that a lot of people are interested, some maybe are. Uh, I've got some minor things to deal with, but yeah, that was definitely... That came from nowhere and it had a dramatic effect. So that's why we weren't uploading on Wednesday, Thursday. We were still farming though. So I did a small bit of joint. I got a lot of dragon. We lived in the dragon's butt crack for quite a, quite a while to be fair. Quite King Angel Mon. Oh, fuck yeah, is that good? Oh, well, I don't know if we're upgrading a champion to max level. Oh, yeah, I'll, I'll get down with that. So I've been doing dragon. Very small bit of spiritual realm. It's more about a giant. I think I've done a bit of food as well. And just like the dailies and whatnot. And so I have been trying to improve my runes and all this type of stuff. And make that account better. But it's basically just been farming when I can because I ain't been moving too much in the arena. I think that's pretty much it. I think it's it's the same thing. If I'm revenging it'll be for the quick one against single target defences. So I think that's possibly it. I did I did get the a, a, a really nice quad roll. The first quad roll of this account I'll have to show you. And it's a really nice stat, perfect for the set that it's in. So we'll show you that. We've got some runes to upgrade anyway. But yeah, it felt like complete crap. I had to pick the kid up Thursday. Uh, Mum come up and gave us a lift down, like so it was nice enough. That helped. So, hence why we weren't... <clears throat> active on that two days so I won't bore you with it anymore but that's the reasons in case you are curious you, do, you, do, you don't have to be it's completely up to you so we're just going to quickly do some rival shit here because part of my IQ disappeared when I uh, on Wednesday when I got a bit of pooter so yeah, we'll go for the easy win here. So we'll do this. Now, we've been doing dragon for a reason. <clears throat> and it's not just been for the gear. Uh, let me see if I, I've got this really nice comment. I want to get the gist of it again. Because it kind of summarised some truths. Now, I wouldn't say it was constructive criticism. i just say it's really nice honesty. So let's make sure this, so it was, so I'm taking into account just like, like when I was <coughs> told do uh, Giants B12 and whatnot, but did that. Same so that led me to go to Dragon, so it was really cool. And uh, so Euros for Dranic 9306, I appreciate the comment, I'm going to take it on board. Uh, first part was about summoning champions and whatnot. 
I am going to summon the champions, but uh, we've got one more battle here. But I'm going to wait. I've got a few more days left uh, because I bought the first five out of ten packs I need for effort again. I've been saving up guild points. I've got, I think, two or three days, maybe two days now left until I can buy five more. Then I'm going to summon an effort. After that, I'm going to probably summon all my scrolls unless by the end of this one I just decide to summon them but that is pretty much the plan because we can summon all that scrolls and then we can have a nice present which could be water different fire different could be a chamomile which is meant to be quite good as well you never know so that would be quite interesting but it is very true but building champions put them in storage which I think I put in storage just for space for basically when I summon champs I've got enough to make food with but that's a, a very nice point as well uh, he mentions speed is probably the most important stat which I agree with it is probably one of the most important stats which is why we're doing this event and doing dragon because I did as you remember my defense tower I did, uh, I did some rage runes, but they didn't really work out, so, in its own time, because speed is probably way more important than probably crit damage, because you're going to get a turn, crit rate is probably more important as well, because you're going to get critical hits, uh, and along, I think, with, um, just runes, I think he's also correct there as well, because I think I'm too early to really be Mr. Picky. I, don't, I wouldn't even say I'm mid-game yet. I'm, say I'm probably close to it. Not really there yet, but... Yeah, if I say like a focus room, which I've probably sold a few. If it didn't have accuracy, if I didn't like how it looked, I would sell it. That was probably the wrong thing to do, because it could have been a broken piece, so... And I take that into account as well, so... I have been... Regardless of the set it's in I do because I've been doing like I say a lot of farming I do have broken pieces which I'm going to keep but uh, yeah um, just a fantastic comment which I love to read I love to hear the whether it's criticism or love hate it doesn't matter I love to read them all I love to hear people's thoughts so it was nice to get some feedback and yeah it's pretty much spot on <clears throat> I've been doing some food. I did debate doing some more fours rather than fives. But it's who to make six star next. And who to make six star next, kind of for progression. That Because that is obviously quite important. We have runes that I've still got to upgrade. But we're going, if I'm not hugely sold on the substats, it's six. Let me see where it goes. If they're quite cool, it's nines. Uh, so first, we'll just go manage, and let's just find. Let's see, can we find a rune that is lucky enough? Yeah, we've got a few here. So HP rune, defense, crit rate, resistance. This is going to nine regardless, because the resistance doesn't really hinder anybody. It's end the game to have like a damage dealer or certain champions with resistance, but I'm not against it. And I think they're all percentage stats. This is a really nice one. And 18 and 12. Yeah, I still fucking like that one. So we're going to be taking more consideration, I think, or... Because I will still have some really crappy runes. And I, I will still sell crappy runes that people will say... But okay, I can't really avoid it, but I can definitely try. So where's the one I was... Because I got a <clears throat> beautiful roll on it. This one right here. I can't remember where I got it from. But I got 32% defense on a determination rune. Oh my fucking God. Love it. Went to 6 to start with, got the first 2, popped right here. Went to 9, popped here again, and I was like, never going to get a quad. 
boomed 32%. Respective rows as well, being quite honest. So that will be a lot of fun. So first quad. I would like to get a few more of them on the speed subject, but that hasn't happened. So, yeah, I loved that comment. It was really cool. I love comments that give advice or you know, steer me in a certain direction because I am new to the game. I'm still relatively new. I'm by no means <clears throat> an expert or whatnot. So, right, we're signed in. Done that. We need to go, click here, build some friendships. We haven't done all the arena we can do yet, but... <clears throat> throw feels kind of... Throw feels kind of weird. So, we should be able to... Yeah, we're going to get some wings, so we'll be able to get our fifth arena battle done. We'll quickly go, just for scenario... We'll put, uh, a, yeah, and for Farm and Dragon, it's basically been that pink crystals I've been using. I have been building up, <clears throat> building up, trying to, the gift box energy again. So I was using these, because I know TOA is a way to start again, which I'll get from there. And I'll see about getting some other monsters, hopefully ready to take in. Why not? So quickly get our final arena battle done. Just so have to do one more. Doesn't matter who it is. <clears throat> Doesn't matter. As long as we're making some points. Because I've been saving these up. I've been saving up. Apart from I spent like 40 or 60 just on like the boosters for dragon. And that is because I was doing the crit damage tower, like the Fallen Keeper tower. I must admit, after that comment, because I was debating crit damage or speed, I'm now heavily leaning into speed. I think, yeah, I think it's, I would rather take a turn than be really kind of crazy and not be taking a turn type of thing, so... <clears throat> We've been building the shit up out of that. Yeah, we've got two more fights we can do for arena. We will come back to that. It's all good. Exploration is doing its thing. Defeat Dragon, I will. Trust me. Uh, so, yeah, we've got Progression Event. Oh, yeah, Progression Event. Also, I've got a really nice Violent Rune, which I will also show you. And it's a nice one because it's a crit to damage one, which I was really happy about. And I like this event because I get my, my unknown scrolls, meaning that I can very easily... Oh, we need to do this as well. Guild content. <clears throat> so, let's go and jump. Oh, this is a good shop as well. I've been buying, like, scrolls for any champion that really fucking appears, in all fairness. It's a really nice, uh, nice thing to have. <clears throat> Throw feels weird. It's very irritating to collect that, so. Killed content. What's this one? Well, I think the rain has started up, but we're supposed to get okay weather but it appears that it is now raining very very it's interesting but it's probably not we've had okay weather for a while so yeah later start than normal but we'll get a little bit done here the update was the most important thing just so you know kind of where we're sitting where we're heading to we're going to be upgrading the speed tower soon. The crit damage, it can't wait. I think we'll do speed because speed is obviously important and 
it will help you take more turns and whatnot. So we'll just we'll do speed because I'm confident we're going to get another tower done with this fever event thing. Right, keep farming, keep farming, build the points up. It's going to be fantastic. Hopefully, get that tower done. Then we'll maybe go back to it. We'll see. We'll try and get the speed one. We'll see if we can kick some ass with that. Because we could do runes and stuff, but there's too much of a risk that most of them are going to suck. And I could probably look into making better teams for this type of content as well. And I, oh yeah, I rebuilt... Um, Oh, sweet. I rebuilt Billiger. I just put gear on him that I had. Some broken kind of pieces, but it is what it is. What's this one here? I'll do that one. Yeah, we'll show, we'll show you Billiger. It's basically for the guild content. He's got a fantastic lead for that. So I was like, well, we'll have to kind of attempt to utilize it like 44% attack boost which is quite ungodly I haven't tried him out though but yeah it's decent attack high crit we could put a crit re crit re a crit lead I couldn't speak for a moment there a crit lead in if we wanted to or something that could buff it but yeah, he's got, I mean, okay, crit damage and all, it's, it is what it is, you, you use what you have, you know what I mean? You make the best with what you've got, so let's just go in, I've got a lot of bloody endure rolls as well. We should probably do a video where I just look through all my runes and be like, so this is what I've got here, this is what I've got here, this is what I've got here. Yeah, what type of event is that? Yeah, I'll do. I think we're a few away from Tartarus, so... Although I think, what was it the other day? I managed to actually go into, I think it was Siege or like the World Guild Battle. And I was victorious. I'm pretty sure I was. Proper happy with myself. Oh, the monster subjugation that happened as well. I did collect all the awards from that. I sold all the runes. They just kind of sucked. Like some were four stars, some were shit. These imps. I must admit, they do look pretty cool. I'm sure that they used to have a little thing back in their heyday. This could probably warrant one or two being built just to see. Are they just like an attack buffer for themselves? I do not know. So the main questions are... Oh, well, the main question might be, do we summon everything... In a couple of days, or do we everything now? Because we will be getting the, the guild shop, we will be getting that for sure. But let's see, so uh, I will show you now. Oh yeah, and uh, this chap here, working on him, it's 96.3. Trying to keep him going. I don't know if she got rebuilt, she's basically... It is what it is. I'm not, I'm not necessarily happy with the build, to be fair. I think she's got a slightly better build, but she just doesn't... Not getting monstrous damage. But if we take a look at Bailey Girl, this is... Just kind of what I had said. So you ha I, need, I wanted to build him uh, for some guild content. Hopefully he doesn't die. He's a low HP. 
You get attack. He's slow, but I mean, a lot of my damage based gear is kind of low speed or no speed. Oh, he's close. Pardon me. And crit damage is just a bit lower, but with good time, it'll improve as everything else does. I don't think anybody went on that. Well, he got upgraded a little bit. I think, yeah, and just some. If I make one more five star, we can six star someone, which should be easy enough. It's just for progression. I would love to work on loads of champions. And if that's the case, I could make God an ungodly I want a four stars. I could summon unknown scrolls for fucking a long time. I take all the four stars to five stars, but the issue then is I've got too many projects. Like the Lucasa was good. And I do I do plan to use her, but did get like Nemesis B9 done, but it's I'm trying to think of it whether I think with Lucasa I need to lose a little bit of speed. Because obviously the speed is capped or we need to go in I think it was just the fact that I was possibly missing somebody that like abused the attack meter. So I think that's what it was. But we are get we're getting there. All in good faith. So where's the so this other rune? The rune we got was in violent and it was and I've got decent runes in half of these but to sit and look through all that could be quite boring. Some people could find it quite interesting. Um, so was it Rage or was it Violent? It was Violent, I think. Yeah, check Violent first. And I believe it was number four. I think that was it there. Crit damage. Some crit rate, this is the ones you get from the, the event we just claimed from, to be fair. I'm sure it was that one. It gave me some nice rolls. I was like, oh, keep that. I got some nice number one runes as well. Drinking some water. Uh, it's a change today, it's strawberry and kiwi. Because it's always good to have a bit of water. So let's go and just let's wipe this off the to-do list. Complete that. We're going to sell some shit. We're probably going to go back up to Dragon's butthole again because why would you not? Why would you not? It is good because like I say, I get more points for that reward. I am super stoked, so claim, 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 you. Yeah, make a wish, will it come true? So it's HP with defense, nice tanky type of start I suppose. Yeah, for just now we'll take a look. Number three, crit damage, resistance, defense. I mean, it's a decent amount of... Okay, that's a... Damn it. Everything there is perfect. It's a number six room that's kind of... Yeah, number four in the flat. I just lose too much stats. Nothing against, obviously. So let's uh, let's do this friend summon things. Yeah, social summons for one thousand love hearts. Yeti, yeah, eh? we could use him at some point. 
we could uh, I think the I've heard the Yetis are supposed to be pretty decent spare harpy I've got another harpy dungeon I don't know if that was I farmed that I'm not sure if I told you guys that pretty good as well pretty good we'll take those and we'll do 10 more and then we'll put the good ones away keep the right ones because they'll all become food. So let's put the rain, the angel mon, not even a rainbow mon, an angel. Put that there, put that there, keep you, keep, keep. I think I've got some of them, but fuck, I've got a few of him. I think, I've seen a video about him, so he might be cool for a future. Yeah, and this is all just to become. This is all. I'll we'll just quickly go and. Right, we need to. Jump in the dragon's ass, I think, but. Oh, yeah, I did. Uh, Hall of Heroes is back on, so we've got six done. I just put it on left it type of thing, so. Um, I'll activate that soon, but this is just to have something going, just to collect more points for that event. While we evolve some of these monsters here to make food, everybody knows we're not shy of making food on this channel, not at all. I just love the food making process of this game, it's super fun. I love it. The amount of food that you would make in Raid, and it's not the same. When you make a 5 star, you've got to level it, and then you get food for it. This, you can just 3 straight to 4, no problem, no issue. It is fantastic, I love it to bits, it's really cool. It saves a lot of time, it saves a lot of <clears throat> resources, especially if you like your free to play or a low spender. It just just it's much more even playing field. There we go, get this summons. Get chicken shit turned into chicken salad, and then we're on to the next one. Because making food is always fun. Right, bingo, bango, bongo. Skill up, yeah, I just hate, it just slows the whole fucking process down, but we're not in a huge rush. <coughs> so 2A Sart is coming soon, which is interesting. I like the fact we're going to get the double damage on continuous. Well, dot damage pretty much. So that should be Punisher's Crypt. Um, get a major speed boost as far as complete, completion time. Can't promise it, but we'll see. Going to be interesting for sure. Take one of you. Just for the sake of it. What they're there for, I suppose, isn't it? You may as well. So there's a couple of fours. Beautiful. Never a bad idea to make food. And we've got... Yeah, she changed up her 
three star to five star. Hey, keep attacking, we'll keep revenging each other, we'll keep getting some points from it. We might as well. Spot on. No idea who they are and I don't have the brain power to find out. <clears throat> so we've got some runes we need to work on. We've got some dragon on in. Well let's go take a look because we've got arena coins and boost fe booster fever. There you go, that's what it's called. Sitting with my little blanket on so keep myself warm so yeah I did put the booster on that one but I didn't do that much I, I sadly got kind of bored with it even it is free to put it on for the first time though so so Sky Tribe is 300 we've got 2400 so this one come back to it yeah speed is important so let's just uh Let's just boost speed. Speed helps everybody. So I reckon crit damage we can come back to because we're still going to be farming regardless. We're not going to be stopping uh, farming for this event by any means. It's not going to happen. And we're close with arena points for that. That one will be also way easier. So we have five levels with Sky Totem, which, I mean, it looks like he's got the same fucking speed to me as soon as it was 99 before, so. I'm not sure how that works, but anyway, we got some more speed. So 12 and we're on our way to 20. We will be attacking it like fucking nothing on the planet. So five, or we could do crit damage at the same time. This crit damage is slightly less expensive. Yeah. Probably is way better just to Because if that helps everywhere, then it's going to be way beneficial. And I do believe the speed tower gets relatively expensive after a certain point as well. So what do we have in here? So yeah, we can just collect all. Thank you. That can stay in there. We're now farming about a dragon. I may put, I may put the booster back on. Got runes that need to be upgraded. I don't think there was any other monsters I made changes to. I was looking at Melia's. But I mean, I think I might leave them where they're at. The Sath. I might try to get slightly quicker. I may change some of this gear because honestly there's some pieces that are in the HP set that have rolled beautifully. I wanted to show you, I'm talking like well over 20%, 24, 27%. So when they get grinded they're going to look pretty badass. So let's take a little look at this. Some rolls I'm going to have to try and screenshot are just... I think it would probably be too boring to show everybody the runes, but some of the rolls, yeah, some of them are fucking badass. Another thing is, you can't really fucking see them all, can you? See if we can find a few that have really nice HP. 
I believe they're still purple, 27%, so there you go, Sart, take that one, we'll get speed elsewhere. Like HP Shield, well, 17%. 14, some defense, 21%, some speed. 13, some defense. So we might change him up, and then what we'll do is, if I get Sart pretty much closer to the melee as it speeds, like 190-ish, <coughs> 188 to 190, I can maybe look at Tar 2, change her so she's slightly quicker, so if our Punisher's crypt, then it's just a case of, we're going to go in quicker, kick his ass quicker. Or we're not going to have the explosions. And what we're going to do is just have the sustainability and the support to keep us alive. But the rolls and certain gear pieces have been very good to us. Cannot complain with that. Yeah, you're flashing because you can now afford something tiny. Uh, we'll come in here. I don't know if, if I've done everything. I think so. Oh yeah, yeah, no, so yeah, we're done there. Okay, okay. So yeah, I mean, we're waiting for guild stuff, but guild stuff will come when... I mean, maybe we could... Because we've got a later start, I don't know how long I'm going to be going for. I'm really quite exhausted. But the update had to be given. If we take a look at the this, I mean, we're just waiting. I got some arcane towers because it was quite funny. I decided just to buy some. Why not? I think we're half, close to halfway to a charge mog as well. So, but the guild, yeah, twenty one hundred points. <laughs> Never took us long, took us not even three days to get the enough points we needed, so one day's left. I hope that's not a lie. Because tomorrow night going into Sunday, we're going to summon that, and hopefully it's going to be real good. <laughs> We do have some in here, like an engraved, uh, quite a few of those. We're keeping the engraved pieces for just now. Mystical summons, energy. Now mystical scrolls. We could summon some of those. LD, you never know, LDs are quite good. And so forth, I'm just trying to think. I've probably got a set of runes. It might be quite boring to sit and watch me do some rune upgrading. It's a thing I've done before, but I think it can be perceived as being slightly boring. So I think, you know what, fuck it. We are going to summon because we may as well... I'm going to need a lot of units... So we may as well just summon them. It makes perfect sense. And you never know. There might be something pretty decent here. So a wind um, elemental. Sweet. Let's just keep on cracking. See if we get a four at least. Be decent. Golems. I don't think I'm looking to build any golems just now. Or randomly any drunken masters. But there's another skill up in case I do decide to get a golem. Mystic Witch, ooh, okay, that's a skill up because in future I probably will because they're cleansers. Okay, so now I've got Marla, I've got the red one, I have the blue one, and I have the wind one. 
Yeah, and I was actually earlier thinking about bombers because I had some pieces and I was like, is this even going to be any good? And I think it was possibly like a number four rune. And it had high attack. No, oh, Chris starts and I was thinking, maybe it wasn't a number four rune. But it just had like the attack and I was like, well, bombers are off of attack so that could be quite good for them so to pull him is also quite nice awesome an imp champion championi now let's keep going Oh, it's a magical archer. Okay, yeah. We'll probably do something with that at some point as well. Let's keep on crack a lacking. A random fact. Earlier, I was. I don't know, like, if how useful it would be. But earlier, I was genuinely thinking to myself, I could uh, build a, like two spectres, and I just happened to pull one. So look, let's take a look. We've got wind scrolls, fire, and water. So let's. Yeah, let's let's not sit on them. Let's just uh, well maybe do a ten pop for a wind just because we're well because we're high rollers. Oh, okay, what are Griffin? That could be pretty decent. Oh, I'll take a four. Oh, it's Hot Boy, Phantom Thief. Who I've got the fire one of, and he's pretty good because he used to stun people like. Ridiculous. AOB decreased defense, and I could probably use him. AOE decreased defense is potentially fucking real. Oh, Inugami. I could use you as well. I do require some books. I require a few skill ups for one of my inigamis, so that'll that'll do. So a water imp and oh lightning oh who is it? Who is it? Oh pirate captain Sweet So if I toss an enemy Okay, we can just defense. Nice. Steals attack bar, that could be cool. Uh, attack speed of ally and monsters and gold content. So that could be fucking good as well. So I must admit, I'm quite happy with some of them pools. Whether I will have the resources to upgrade half of these, probably not. I can take a lot of the threes to fours, but then I mean, fours to fives. But I don't want to have too many projects. I like working on champions, but I want to make sure that I'm, I'm still progressing to a certain point. Talwest, I've got books for him for days. Mystic Witch, hey, I'll 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 take skill ups. I need skill ups for every single one of them. Cause I've already got every single one of them. Wind scrolls. Do you mean that when you go to that temp up here? I think if I never read the message, I probably would never have did the temp up. But there's no point sitting on scrolls when you don't know what you're sitting on. You may as well pull them. Okay, that could be okay. That giant warrior could be fun. Oh shit. Oh, teacup bunny. Okay. I've got multiple of her now. 
another ski, uh, skillet for Inagami, another golem, which is a book, yeah, so some decent looking champions there. LD, let's, I mean, realistically, we can't, we can't to be unhappy with LDs because they're LDs, you know what I mean? That's the enemy. Twice weakens the enemy's defense and inflicts continuous damage for two turns. Small chance, but good. It will be dealing damage proportionate to your defense. Inflicts dot damage. And for every harmful effect, it increases by 30%. Increases the enemy's chances of landing a glancing hit passive. So yeah, yeah, that's pretty good. Glancing glancing hits are at times lifesavers. They really, really are. Because you know some oh, Elven Ranger will be keeping you for damn sure. Rapid fire shots. Attacks an enemy, stunning it for a turn. Nice chance to do that. Aims to deal substantial damage. Fucking hell. If the enemy is frozen, stunned, or asleep. See, that's... I could have a lot of fun with that champion. Give it time. I could put her in. Get somebody to stun first. Load her up with some nice damage, and then you just never know what you're going to get. And Dark... Or, yeah, Dark Martial Cat... Spinning points, two consecutive attacks on an enemy, attack bar decreasing, and eye for an eye, attacks the attacker with a crit to inflict damage proportionate to your attack power, and stuns the target for one turn with a 40% chance on attack with a crit hit. And they, yeah, nice enough looking. Pools there. We have one, but we're still going to fucking pull it regardless. If I was going from one, I I wish I had a bloody clue. Uh, I mean, I would take I would take the twin to be fair. Like the twin would be cool. I'm not getting the twin, but it, it, it would be cool. Because when TOA, a picky on priest. Because when TOA restarts again, we're going to have a lot more of these engraved things coming on, so. We're going to keep those until we get our effort but in the meantime we've got some charms to put into storage charms to put into storage so some, some nice champions as well the bombers are very interesting i must say that's a skill up for fucking megan that is or linda whichever one i build i build first to be fair I did debate do a second a second spectra. That'd be funny. Two spectres for dragon. One quick, one a bit slower, so one could go in quickly. Decrease attack bar, then the other one goes in. When it's a bit slower, same thing. Stopping the enemies taking a turn. That could be real. That could be a lot of fun, whether it would work or not. That is a different story. So it may not work, but you never know. And until you, you don't really know until you try. Uh, 
I hate these bottles with the water, they're so flimsy. Proper slightly flimsy bottles like. As soon as you touch that bottles, I swear to God, it's just crack, crack, bang, crack, bang. Give it a break already. Come on. So it's 61 pieces there. We're looking. No, I wasn't anything important on the phone. So yeah, we're going to build these up. We're going to build up fever ones and we're just going to keep on going. We're going to try and get the speed to as high as we can. Because every tower we've got eventually will be upgraded. It's just a matter of time. I mean, we could have made great strides again with a uh, damage, but yeah, speed will will just help us out way better if we're being completely honest. So let's go with speed tower. Fuck it. Let's go with the speed tower. So we need to make sure we've got uh, food. Our LD summoning piece, so we could actually get a few of them. And I could summon a hundred, but it's just a bit of hate to drag them all out of the sealed shrine thing. I would rather just put some in, keep the rest out. A little bit less dicking around, to be fair. So, Hence why I do it like that. Uh, two, you could be a book for somebody else. Uh, and that's Let's make some food. I think that 10 pop is almost done as well, so we we'll have to, oh, a weird noise coming from outside. Have to check the runes, and then we're going to farm again. I might put the booster back on, I might not. I might just let it kind of pick up any rune set. And kind of put it into the hands of fate. And so we can guarantee we're getting more points. And it's never a bad thing. You, sh you should be farming dragon and giants for a long time anyway. Or we could do some giants and put the swift one back on. And you never know. We could be getting our first quad speed roll pretty soon. Until you try, you never know. Much to think about. Let's take the tree. Instead of making you paper, we're just going to make you complete mulch. Some food. Froggy, you'll do. Who's next? We're going to just make as much. 
sad thing is I can do this for hours if I'm just like fucking around kind of sitting around the house and whatnot I will summon until I've got like no monsters left I'll just make a fucking shitload of these it's quite it's quite funny but it needs must to a certain point it does help progress I want to be six star in loads of champs but uh, when I get my second ifrit I'm going to take a break from buying the ifrits from I know I've got to summon them five times so Realistically, I've got to do it five times, but now we'll take a break and it won't be for scrolls. We're not going to be buying scrolls and shit. It's a complete waste. There's Rainbow Man and Angel Man we could look into. At least to get in a few of those. Oh, the, that's just, I've got an idea then. That's the case, we'll just make it a two. And the three stars. Guess what happens to them? They become four stars. Yay. There you go. I should be able to tap like the screen there instead of having to hit the OK button. It make things way quicker. Just a very small change. So not less less of this back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Four star, four star, four star, four star. One more four star. And then we have a five star, and then we have a five star. Or making food. Oh, the wind is picking up outside the bloody hell. We're going to have a storm. And I'm going to have to at some point check. Um, well, it's got, we're going to six anyway. We hit accuracy, we can maybe get rid of that attack. What goes on number nine? It's four speed. Yeah, we'll keep it in eventually. Maybe do something with it, we'll see. So HP's got two shit starts and one good start. Ally shield is HP. It gives you a lot of crit. Uh no. See, and hence why I said I'll probably still sell ones that people will say are good. Because understandings might be different. But yeah, sadly, it, it is what it is. Okay, I'll lower that crit damage for a HP champion then. Broken piece? Oh, you hit a taxi. Hitting that attack just kind of clashes with like them two up there. I'm not a fan of it. It was, it was really good until then. Okay, if you avoid attack on this one, I'll broken piece it. See, attack and defense. I'm trying to think, is like, what's the. It's not some champions that attack and defense will work. Yeah, I think it's actually the Inigamis. Yeah, no, get it of you. Oh, you know we're going to be putting this to straight to nine. Twenty five percent HP, Jesus. I swear HP rolls are one of my luckiest. Kid you not. By far one of my 
luckiest, so... So for endurance... I mean... I mean, two crap starts don't really overpower the good one. But that's going to stick where it is. What do we have here? Defeat the dragon? Absolutely. Number four rune in its flat defense. See, so you. That, I swear, I always get a really crappy roof from here. I don't fucking know why. It never says, hey, you work hard. You're never away from here. Like, literally, I'll keep this thing charging the whole day. And then, yeah, I'm constantly farming. Doing this, doing that. Trying to get, like, better, quicker. You can't even give me one fucking good room from there. This fuck is... Like, come on, what else do I have to do? Oh, you know we're buying those nine on knolls. And the determination... Oh, it's got def... You know what? Because we got the quad, let's buy that one as well. And now we can be disappointed because we're about to roll it. I guarantee we're going to be so disappointed. And I say that with just pure honesty, because we probably fucking will be. The fuck is that? No. Come on. I mean, it's not the worst sub. I would have liked some to go on to defense. I won't lie. I really would have liked it just to just to be cooler. And I can't remember where his number four room went, but I believe I gave him one. And then I believe I possibly took it away again. Look at the dimension hole energy because we can't buy any yet, which is honestly infuriating because we're so bloody close. And we've got two, like 96 to 3.1% away. At 96. 96.9, 96.3, which is 3.7. If only we had enough to finish him, or if I was allowed to buy, I would come to us, make an option. Or a different store where you can buy dimensional whole energy. Makes the game way better. There's more things to do when you can awaken champions slightly quicker or you, if you have access to quicker energy. A lot of games have the, their own little quirks how they do it and they'll give you the chance to kind of get more energy so Look into it, come to us. Come on. Get with the bloody program. So let's take a look at who could... Because I think as soon as Sat is... Which I assume when I wake up, we should be able to finish Sath. I keep saying Sath, it's annoying. I'm just going to say Sath instead. 
so I think in terms of that we could potentially look at his uh, Eight five six five nine eight. Fucking hell, that's a dramatic increase. Actually, it probably wouldn't hurt to get him because it, I'm pretty sure two A. It just says places. Right, things will say just now has a chance and so forth. Well, it does actually say that it requires accuracy, but you still need some. There will be natural resistance for whatever, for um, in-game bosses and so forth. So it's better to have some. Looking forward to getting him up and going. If it's wave clear, he could be good in a lot of places. To be fair, he could be quite decent. I mean, I think like, Alicia is quite good. There is a few, like the Mystic Witches and whatnot are quite good. Theomars. I need to get Essences to awaken him first, I think. That would be the best option. Howell's good for healing. There's genuinely just a lack of... Because there's so many good options... To six star like Bernard, I think could be good for TOA as well. See, I've been looking at this dude for a while. I've probably got a couple of books for him to help with TOA. So a, it's a single attack and defense break. See, that could be quite good for a lot of places as well. You make him really quick. That's why it's sometimes kind of like, damn, it's just so tricky because there's so many good choices, comes hard decisions. But quickly, we can definitely take a look. And we've got uh, Eladriel, who I need to awaken. I will have to do some farming for that. I think she could be good. Uh, I think later on, I think more arena, they're good. Possibly her as well. So a couple of Mystic Witches. So continuous damage. AOE, defense break. See, that's... I need an AOE defense break. So I may actually have to just do her. Because the AOE defense break will help everywhere. I've got attacks on enemy and does the defense break, but 
AOE defense break is slightly better. So I'm going to probably, the plan is, I think I might do her next. And I can probably awaken her as well. She's level 35, so it's probably about her time. I'm going to summon more champs to make some more chickens first. That way... <sighs> Tiredness is coming on quick. That way, I always like to try and make a few extra more chickens. It's just easier for when I get to... Six turn someone. I really don't want to do it with them when I've got five. It just feels like a bigger mountain to climb. Yes, you can buy them and whatnot. But I still like to put in a little bit of the work to create some food for you know that process. Uh, so and we have we need as I said we need, did we say we needed one more four star? So we can do that because we have uh, Rainbow Mon. I'm actually tempted just to fucking do it now. And just put in the graft. Because the defense break is genuinely... That could be for TOA, that could be for certain dungeons. It could be for Arena. And the Mystic Witches are, a lot of them are really bloody good. And I have too many good champions, I believe so. I need to just maybe work on six star and some fucking champions. <laughs> so yeah, we're going... For some reason I always make the greys the levelling up material so no 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 don't be stupid I've done that god fuck so many times it is not funny I'm not a fan of it it breaks my damn heart I got to say Five star motherfucker. So let's grab her. Needs to be awakened as well. The defense defense break is cool. She had runes on, but I'm trying to think what the fuck's her runes on for. That's a cleanser. Like the high resistance is good. She's got a hundred percent. It's slightly fucking overkill, but not the worst. Well, one of the Elven Rangers, I think. It's just more books I need. I can do okay with books towards them because I do have a respectable, oh, I don't, a respectable amount of books for them. And I bet you when I go take a look, it's way less than I thought and I look stupid. So let's give you a little surprise. Yay! Hey, yeah, I'll take that energy. I will take it. Life is full of surprises. I never really expected to six star or summon anything. But that's why you take chances. You have fun. Uh, what the fuck was I going to do again? That's it. I was going to go in here and I was going to take a look at. Just mid. I need some of the mid, so if I can double check how many high essences I've got, we can potentially break down. So uh, 
was it 15 or was it 10 and I'm just going a bit senile in the motion of things yeah, and we're always going to collect that because that's how you roll we're going to click on her again again it was 15 that's perfect then hello Rebecca So what we'll do is, because that defense break is awesome, I like the whole, it removes harmful effects from all allies, that's a good little Fran style heal, so has got the defense break, which fucking really nice. So see, we guess, so we need to go back to here, I want to check how much skill ups because we need we're going to need a few so it would be monster storage don't know if it would be no okay shield shrine come on let's take a look So four blue, but how many do I have? Okay. Let's start with four because I want to be a bit fucking anal and just keep one. <laughs> Don't need to build more than one, it would be fucking stupid, so. Oh no, nah, we do need. We're in dire fucking need. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. Fucking hell, seven more. Seven depends. How much really? See, that's a, a light and dark one, so we ain't feeding her, not a damn chance. Not a chance. I'm going to keep one because it'd be stupid not to. Like, stop just random champions. We are short on a few, that's fine. At some point, I think it's just two way, it should be like a thousand times better, but. Jealousy, oh, okay. To be fair, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not adverse to not booking anything else right now. And I say that purely because. If we take a look, 5 out of 5, perfect. So we've got the Power of Jealousy, Defense Break for 2 turns. If the enemy has beneficial effects, it's guaranteed. This one 3 turns, 2 turns. Cleanse, it was a nice 3, three turns, so yeah, cool. And a nice uh, accuracy aura in arena. I still think she's going to be fucking pretty nice. So, I'm going to continue to summon a little bit more. You have stuff happening in the background as always. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just going to... I'm just going for it. I hate pulling the champions out. I do. I really do. Oh, you're a book. I need you. Absolutely needed that now. <coughs> Let's go see what we're not taking out of storage. Let's see what crap we're going to leave in storage. 
And the easiest way to do it is go lowest grade and just start tapping. Seven, twelve, seventeen, twenty-three, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty-one, thirty-seven, forty, forty-three, forty-six, forty-nine, fifty-four. Fifty-nine, sixty-three, sixty-seven, sixty-nine, seventy is one ten, baby. Okay, we've got a few stragglers to fucking catch up. That's okay. Food will be made. Uh, we know exactly what we're going to be fucking doing to do that. <sighs> yeah, we're slightly shorter on episode length as compared to what we normally are. I believe we're still over an hour or so, which is good. But we kind of got the update done to where I, I think you're all caught up with where the account is, what we've been doing, uh, what we've. I could say what we're trying to do, but there's a lot to do, so we're just going to tr we're potentially just going to try to do a lot of it type of thing. Just try to do a lot of the a lot of good work. There's more champions. I want a six star for. TOA, have to get TOA hard done. Sath tomorrow, or today, it's after midnight. He's only a few, you know, there's only a few, uh, what do you call it? It's only a few dimension hole energy away from getting too aid. We'll check his build. I may change it, I may give him higher HP items. I want to stack him with HP, get him close to the speed of his teammates, and we may not need Tattoo, we may just have to try Veremos and. We just try Veremos and. What do you call it again? Riley. That could be a fun team. So. I think we're going to leave it there. I'm going to wait to work on food. I've got to. I'll maybe do runes later. <coughs> Pardon me. Although I just, I just remembered something uh, that we could bet, or the account could benefit from. Okay, it's the, yeah, it's the power up option. Yeah, fucking give me a break. Uh, did it, did it, did it, did it, did it. it should be in so it's in the sealed shrine then isn't it oh but okay maybe you don't have to have any do there we go baby you get our fucking skills upgraded and oh we're oh we're close two more oh well it's a work in progress um but yeah this is a way to finish which means i may put it back onto a certain type of rune I'm not hugely sure. Um, we will see. I may check. I 
I don't think I really need accuracy. I think I'm quite good for accuracy rolls. But I have a broken perspective. I'm going to keep it like that. I'm quite good. Yeah, I think possibly because there's a few people I want to put in violent, I may just stick with that. It seems like the most kind of unisex slash versatile unit friendly type of gear set. So we're going to kill this dragon soon or he'll kill us. We need to strip the buff. There you go. Some good hits will get him. Come on, come on. Some good hits can get him. Come on, get him. I think a one of every a hundred runs we get one or two losses. If it's bad RNG. Yeah, uh, so number six is flat, so I'll get rid of that. This is a guard during this attack. Um, I mean, if it rolls okay, I'll utilize it as a broken piece. It's definitely to my advantage to get more champions, at least put into, oh fucking hell that's nice, put into runes for the very first time, give them a taste of the action, so revenge, speed crit damage, I mean if it hits HP three times they'll be super upset, it never, okay, maybe the, maybe I'm good then, so attack HP ally shield, yeah okay, Let's see what it goes first. Oh, okay. Flat HP. Oh, beautiful. I never thought that would happen in a million years and it did. Yeah, this possibly... Uh, I mean, if it hits resistance, I'd be slightly upset. Thank you, it did it crit damage accuracy. I'll take it. I can work with that. I can, a damage dealer still can put on debuffs, I'll work with that. Shield rune. Yeah, that stats are kind of horrible, so. Uh, let's go and, like, don't show me this again. Yes, fuck off. I am using, I'm using the shop just because I want to build up energy from or for the inbox. Uh, let's put the let's put the booster back on. We do have spiritual realm, but I put it on if it was free. And I thought I'll do some of that, and I haven't done that much. But I tell you what, I will. I pro. I guarantee you, I will fucking. I will absolutely fucking farm the crap out of this. So I have the energy. I'm happy to use all of these crystals for energy as well. Absolutely so. So I think I've spoke I've spoke more than long enough. I've got to go make some food. I may do it in the morning though. <sighs> May do it in the morning when the kid goes to kickboxing. I'm slightly tired, so yeah, that's your update. That's what we've been up to. That's what we're gonna get up to. I'm gonna just try and work and make this account uh, a bit better and as good as it can be. And hopefully, the next time I see you. I'll have some more champions rounded up and a two-way south, so with all the love for me you can handle, guys, thanks for watching. Take care, and I'll see you next time.